Hi guys, welcome to another Skyblue Simulation Softstream video. My name is Skyblue aka Drew. For this flight, we'll be doing a long haul, but we're going to be splitting the video into departure and arrival. We're going to be taking the South African A340-600 uh, by Tourlist version 1.1.2, I think, on X-Plane 11. Taking it from Johannesburg, Tambo International to Heathrow. 10 hour 36 mil flight. Cruising altitude is going to be actually 32,000 initially. So a lot of fuel, a lot of passengers. We'll go ahead and get started from cold and dark, more or less. So chocks are set, landing gear doors are down, mm -hmm. APU area is clear. Okay. Okay, we're gone, engine masters are off, weather panel can't be set yet. Place can GCS auto. Okay, okay gears down. All batteries are on, so all power is on, IR1, now. IR2, nav. IR3, nav. A340, 642, 556, Bravo-61. Init, we're going to do an init request from F. A O R to E G L L. Actually, wait, is there not an init request here? Uh, stand by. I forgot how to do this. Is it Atsu and then AOC? Flight init. Oh, really? Wait. I forgot how to do this. It's in it. Uh, we need to reset the. Uh, data. Aircraft status. So let's uh, change the IREC database so that we can get the uh, link going up again. Request, five plane daily in progress. There we go. Flight number is SAA23. There we go. And, uh, that's actually 320. Briefing, departures. Okay, NADP two. Alright. So zero three left. Or Tambo ground. Okay. Okay. APU fire test. Let's turn on the APU now. APU master on. And APU start. If you bleed, make it slightly cool. Recall doors. Oxygen pressure, hydraulics, check quantity, engines, check oil. Status of the aircraft is normal. Left zero is selected. Speed brake, parking brake on. Mac press is not on the green graph of pressurizing blue elect pump for Roger. Get the AccuPress on. Gen 1, 2, 3, 4, and Amber. Conversion equipment, light jackets, crash axe with all his hoods, full of stock transfers, washing match flashlights, and escape ropes. Circuit breaker panel, swing phone gauge to extend a walk around. So, let's see here. Have VA, 
and yeah, we got the chocks on. Fuel request amount one one six point five two zero. Hey, never mind. That should be good. So just to cross check, it's two seventy two at six hundred, correct? Kevin, not yet. Okay, pilot flying, flow, white lights off, control push button, back switch captain, now logo one, strobe lights auto, seat belts on, no smoking signs auto, more mercy exit lights, norm, AP bleed is on, Let's see if you like DC, batteries, one and two off, one and two on. Charging. Look. No my lights. Engines fire test. Okay. All checked. 3.5. Oh, we can test this? Nice. Okay. Didn't know that. Box reset, anti skid on, and timers are reset. Side wall, cockpit door test. Let's see the lights on. Cockpit door controls, dual light. Okay, above, standby, make it auto, just standby instead. Get the ATIS on 126.2. Transition level 9 or 0. Advise on initial contact, you have information in here. Yeah, Tampo International Airport, it is information India. 1400. Surface west 330 degrees, 9 or not, varying between 300 and 360 degrees. Tav OK. Temperature plus 2 1. Dew point plus 6. QNH1027. Departing runway 03 left. Arriving runway 03 right. Expect ILS approach. Transition level 9 or 0. Advise on initial contact you. Okay, so QNH is 1027. We're expecting 8000 as for the chart. We'll go ahead and uh, get Tambo Ground online. 8.1. Or Tambo. That's what he's called. We're at Alpha 7 with information India. And let me get the chart up here. Or Tambo Ground. Hello, Springbok 238, spot Alpha 7A340, requesting clearance to London Heathrow, information India. Springbok 238. Just cleared to London Heathrow after takeoff runway 03 left. Comply with the BASH 03 Alpha departure. Initial climb to 8,000 feet. Departure frequency will be South Africa control on 128 decimal 325. Squawk 4076. That's from Buck 238. Say again the departure name only. The departure name. <laughs> Vasya 3 Alpha. Okay, Spinbrock 238 cleared London Heathrow after runway 3 left. Comply with the Vasya 3 Alpha departure. Climb 8000 initially. Departure frequency South Africa control on 128.325. Squawk 4076. Spinbrock 238, feedback is correct. You can report ready for push and start. We'll call you back for push and start. Thank you, Spinbrock 238. Okay, Vasher, 
Russia, two, three, eight. Okay, so we're squawking four zero seven six. Okay, four zero seven six. Vassier. And let's see here. Yeah, there was something else. Is there any three left? Vassier. Three alpha, none. Insert. Oh. Okay, that's weird. So Nissan. So Vassier three alpha, not Nissan. Try to climb under radar control. Okay. Oh, so then as filed. Step climbs inserted. Then we have two seven right. And then Ooh, wait. Stand by. The long, wrong chart set. LS3 right. Yes. LS27 right from Biggin Hill. This LFPG okay. by mod me. It's T7, right? By mod me, yeah, that's it. LFPG T7, right as well. By Bibax, Bibax on Alpha, Mine Echo rather. Okay, diffs, copy secondary, Flat War, Rayless 3 right. What did I pick here? We write Zulu. Yeah, we might be holding there if you write Zulu. GSV one probably. Temperature two one. Wind is three three zero at niner. Kinesh is one zero two seven. ILS three right Zulu, it's five seven one zero. Radnav, uh, for departure first, Vazir 3 Alpha, the JSV 351. In it, yeah, that's good. Uplink takeoff data, so we have flaps 3, and the wind is 330 at 9. Okay, take out data request. Once you receive the takeoff data, we'll input that into our perf. So flex takeoff, flex 32. We'll insert that uplink, any DP2 for departure. So 5,560. That's going to be 
frog, it's going to be four, three, four, left. Okay, so graphic output, Google Slow Power, Roger, Slow Power, and Chucks as well. Round of cockpit, please. Round of cockpit to go is driving up. We'll drive everything away. We'll do a PA. Uh, one me taxi. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, from the flight, no, we'll do it now. Ladies and gentlemen from Flight Deck, your crew speaking on behalf of this Cape Town based crew. Welcome aboard South African Airways Flight 238 with service from Johannesburg to London Heathrow. Appreciate your business in choosing South African Airways, even though you have other options. The choice was yours, but the pleasure definitely ours. We'll be pushing back in about five to ten minutes once we do. Um, we'll be taxiing to the runway. It should take about ten more minutes once we're, we've taken off. Wheels up. Flight time will be about 10 hours and 36 minutes, cruising uh, finally at about 36,000 feet. Looking at the weather, we're expecting a smooth okay. ride for most part. Uh, in Central and North Africa, we might get uh, some uh, some what of a bumpy ride. Nevertheless, if the ride does smoothen out, we'll try to get the seatbelts off as zero as possible. Continue to keep your seatbelts on for your safety and the safety of others. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the rest of the flight. And we'll get back to you as we get closer into the London Heathrow area, or should there be any significant developments during the flight. Once again, from the flight deck aboard this South African Airways flight, welcome aboard, y'all. Cabin crew, arm doors for departure and cross check. Okay, let's do a briefing. So, first of all, instrument cross check. KH1027, FD zone, average 20 constraints, BR1 and 2, speed dashes, and dashes, and EBS, 8000 set, BS dashes. Oxygen mast is assumed tested. BFD reading, climb blue, nav blue, and FD2, blow 40 knots, 156 blue, 175 magenta. Loose level, altitude check, indicating 5,590 feet on KH1027. Difference of 10 within limits. 8,000 blue, heading and tracking 296. ND reading, ground speed 0, passing position, heading and tracking 296. VR1 hard to the Jasper VR. Pressure line, vibration auto, 50 feet. Status of Eurocraft is normal. Okay, departure briefing as follows, but first we will brief the. Um, We'll brief the departure clearance. So runway three left, Vazur three alpha departure, eight thousand initially is walking four zero seven six. So for chart ten dash three mic ten June twenty two effective sixteen June four or Tampa International Johannesburg South African Republic SID same charts same charts. MSA Johannesburg V O R East sector seven thousand eight hundred West sector eight thousand four hundred. Transition altitude is 8,000. Contact Johannesburg radar frequency at 6,500. Advise radar of level passing on first contact from what seat check. Cross CDR boundary at or above 8,000. Simultaneous approach. Uh, use of parallel 23 left and right, 21 left and right. General aviation traffic up to 7,500. Speed max 250 knots at or below 100. We will be asking for a high speed climb. Climb to 8,000, climb further under radar control, Vazir 3 Alpha, climb on runway track to 5.5 DME, Johannesburg to left, 311 track, and intercept radial 351 of Vazir, and then as per flight plan. Fuel prediction, we got our extra fuel of 4.6 tons or 30 minutes. Pilot flying briefing, so chart 10-9 Charlie, departing chart, 20 April 22, same chart, same chart. We'll be pushing back onto the apron A taxi lane facing south. And then we'll be starting all engines 1, 2, 3, and 4, chart 10 9, 8 October 2021. Same charts, same charts. We'll expect either left on Fox chart, right on Alpha, and then full length takeoff on Bravo. Or we could go taxi lane Alpha, Bravo, and then we'll take the full length from there. We're going to 3 left, we're heading is 0, 3, 4. I will be, we might pass through hotspots 1 and 6, described in 10-9 alpha as uh, from 8th October 2021, intermediate takeoff point, taxi, all aircraft taxi was 3 left to 1 right on ground frequency, all aircraft vacating the runway or crossing runway from east on entire frequency. 6 is exercise extreme caution and taxi southbound on Bravo to runway 3 left, the taxiway bends to the east approximately 40 miles, meters, after passing intersection India and Mike and continues straight ahead. So beware of that. So on takeoff, we'll be a on takeoff with the radar on. 
You have enough stop margin in case you have to abort the takeoff. Uh, out of below V1. If you encounter a problem with departure, we'll call out our intentions. Pan pan. Get vectors for holding until we get below our maximum landing weight. Otherwise, our EOS ID has um, climbed to probably 10,000 and then hold on these 206 radial of Johannesburg to burn, uh, might be burning fuel or somewhere else. If it's a line ASAP red, no option. We have to turn right uh, downwind and runway three right and commence emergency landing there. So threats, again, we are a heavy aircraft. We do need to burn fuel if we need to return back. Parallel operations, T only on departure. We're night run, it's uh, night time, so taxi slow if you have to. And unfamiliar airport, cross check with your charts, single pad operations, uh, configure early as required. And if nothing else, then our departure briefing is complete. Okay, cockpit preparation check using gear pins and covers, remove fuel quantity. It's uh, 116,440 kilograms balanced. Seat belts on, eight years. Nav, Baref, QNH1027, QNH1027. Cockpit preparation checklist complete. We'll go ahead and call for push and start. Spring Brock 238 information India, request push and start. Push and start approved, phasing south, Spring Rock 23. Super saddle, parking brake on. Four star checklist, parking brake on. Take off speed and thrust, V1156, V1170, V2175, flex 32. Windows closed, beacon on. Four star checklist complete. Wheel lights on as well. Air for couple, air for push, facing south. Okay, facing south. Please show me where you want to go. Okay. So connected and bypass inserted. Release parking brake. Brakes released. Ready for push. Starting pushback. And you may start engines. Roger, we'll start uh, all engines on two, three, and four. Big aircraft to push. Let's go ahead and start engine one. Engine one, engine start selector ignition, no amber crosses. Bleeder on engine one and two. Engine one master switch on. Engine two master switch on. I think the issue 4600 is supposed to push back from here, I'm not too sure. Engine one stable. Engine two stable. No ammo crosses. Bleed air on engines three and four. Engine three master switch on. Engine four master switch on. Again, A340 also tail strike, so pitch for. Uh, 7.5 once airborne pitch for 12.5. Break set, pressure up. Disconnecting tow, stand by. Stand by.
does the Earth 3 out. Engine 3 stable. Engine 4 stable, engine starts to like turn on. If you boot off, if you master off, control on spoilers, reset letter trim. Flaps 3. Flaps 3. Yep, flaps 3 selected. Alright, so now we'll clear disconnect cancels on the right side. Missiles of SRC, we have a start checklist, NTIS, engine off, wing off, ECAM status, check, pitch trim, uh, 25%. Yeah, 20, correction, 27.2%, rudder trim, neutral, after start checklist complete. Spin rock 238, information, India, request taxi. Holding point Lima, runway 03 left, via the apron left on Foxtrot, right on Alpha, left on Lima. Hold short runway 03 left, expect further taxi to Juliet. Taxi holding point, runway 03 left at Lima, via left Foxtrot, Alpha, Lima, hold short 3 left. Expect taxi. Expect further taxi, Juliet. Springbok two three eight. Side go left side. So foul. Okay. So turn off camera. Nose lights taxi. Camera on. Parking brake off. Yes. Yeah, so <laughs> this is kind of. Uh, I don't think we'll be using the taxi camera. There we go. Come on, move. Okay, what is the <clears throat> shift? 300 meters shift. Okay, please do that. Right side, go left side. Brakes check. Pressure zero. Ooh, there's performance. Nice. I love it, man. Coming soon. One, five, two, okay. We'll do a flight controls check in a bit. 
Okay, go left side, clear right side. First of all, departure, change checklist. Departure, change checklist. Runway SID, runway 03 left at Juliet, 03 left at Juliet, and uh, VAS 03 Alpha. Stand by. Left setting, config 3, config 3, take off speed and thrust. V1152, VR170, V2175, flex 32. FC altitude 8000, departure change checks. Flight control check. Fall up, fall down, neutral, fall left, fall right, neutral rudder, fall left, fall right, neutral. Okay, take off confirmation briefing again. Remember zero three left at holding point Juliet. Vazir three alpha eight thousand initially squawking four zero seven six checked. Lima, there we go. Right side, go left side, left on Lima. Spin rock two three eight zero three left short of Lima. Cross runway 03 left at Lima, then taxi right onto Charlie, right onto Juliet, hold short runway 03 left at Juliet. Cross runway 03 left at Lima, to continue taxi right on Charlie, right on Juliet, hold short of runway 03 left at Juliet, spring block 238. Crossing to the left, runway clear, approach clear, strobe lights are on. Mm -hmm. Your left side, clear right side, Charlie. Strobe lights auto. What's wrong with the X camera? It's not configured properly, I think. There's a yaw? No, it's not. Hey, thank you for the ATC 108 decimal one spring block two three eight. See ya. Tambo Tower, hello, Springbok 238, runway 03 left at Juliet. We'll be ready for departure upon reaching. Reaching. 03 three, left, go for takeoff. Springbok 238. Can <clears throat> crew cease for takeoff? Okay, T only. 
If you left, would you like confirm? If you left, at Juliet confirm. Line up checklist, take off running. Runner three left with Juliet. Runner three left with Juliet. TCAS, TA, packs one and two. On, line up check is complete. Approach clear. Runway clear. Ready? Okay. It's kind of weird, sure. Ready? Ready. Take off. Check. Looks like 32 SRS runway, auto trust blue. Gear up. Now. Good day, one two eight decimal three two five spring block two three eight seven. Close climb, climb, all blue off rest. Did we do forget the taxi checklist? No, we didn't. Because we called out contact three. Yeah, setting speed, one, three, nine. Flaps one. Uh, South African control, hello, Springbok 238 Airborne, 7000, climbing 8000, Vassar 3 Alpha. Flight level 320, spread block 238, and request high speed climb for performance. Rude Red Rudas and high speed approved, thank you. Spread block 238. Set flight level 320.
pass and transition altitude, pulse standard, standard set, cross check, passing level 8, 1, now checked, no difference, left 0, speed check, left 0, So our um, 10,000 foot flow is at uh, level 150. So does there air space in with us? Yeah, it does. Passing level 155, landing lights off, landing lights off, seatbelts off, airports, and ND was not on, I'm sorry for that. Yeah, we didn't do the takeoff. Well, we did, because the takeoff contract was more. 
A lot of lapses in my flows, I apologize. Got me secondary, clear out there. I guess the active again. Oh, what? You have to go through rest control? No, freaking way. Yeah, travel 2 7, right. It's okay, I think. Um, it's very understandable. I guess we're up to prepare for the arrival as well, so no problems. Oh, we don't have to go through. Oh, this is. Nice. Alright, guys, so we'll get back to you as we get closer to Heathrow. Until then, see ya! Hey everyone, welcome back to the Skyblue Simulations video. We are about 220 miles to Heathrow, so that's about touching down and about 40 minutes our top descent is just up ahead in 11 minutes. So we'll try and prepare for the arrival. Heathrow approach is online, so we'll have some ATC, and that's good for us. So anyway, we'll go ahead and prepare for the arrival. Mock up cruise nav, AP1, MFD2, Autothrust, level 380, next wave point, Charlie Lehman, Mike, rather. On Unicom 122.8, we will be monitoring 119.25, 725, uh, your controls and comms, ground is going to be 128.075, Two seven right is going to be the arrival. That's good for us. Yeah, it starts so. Yeah. Aliso one hotel. So Aliso. Rotno Advax. Tiger. Biggin. Biggin. One correct. So a thousand one hundred. Three thousand on track three one six. Correct. MSA. The final approach course will be two six nine and eighty nine. Radnav, is there an alternate approach we can do? We only have London, that's it. L O N. GL 27 right, correct. Approach. So, transition level 75, when it's your level 2. The 
that's going to be 20 and 1007. Two seven right category one is two seven eight. I'm consulting a Google Sheets document for the runway, uh, the distance. Rather, <clears throat> you have calculated with auto brake high will be alpha eleven. Seven left. Him. Ooh, London Center's online. Does he cover us? Yeah, Aliso. Nice, we're getting more ATC. <laughs> okay, full config three, secondary two seven left two seven seven. I'm gonna monitor a London control on one two nine point four two five. Are you ready for a briefing? We'll do the PA first. Please cross check my work. <coughs> okay. Ladies and gentlemen from FlyTech, your crew speaking on behalf of this Cape Town based crew. We're about five minutes to descending into London Heathrow to be touching down in London Heathrow in about uh, 20, correction, about 30 minutes. Weather information in London, got some winds out from the south, cloudy skies, temperature is uh, 20 degrees Celsius and looks like we are slated for an on-time arrival. Again, we appreciate you for choosing South African Airways as your life choice heading to London Heathrow. Even though you have other options, the choice was yours and the pleasure definitely ours. Later transiting through our final destination is London Heathrow. We wish you a safe and pleasant journey all the same. For more information on the arrival, with your baggage claim info and connecting flights, gate agents on the ground will be happy to assist. Sit back, relax, enjoy the rest of the flight. And again, keep your seatbelts on even if the sounds are off for your safety and the safety of others. Even though we are expecting a smooth ride all the way down to London Heathrow. Once again, we hope to see you another South African Airways flight, but until then, we'll see you. Kevin Crew, from the camera for Ralph, please. Okay, my controls. Oh, no, not yet. Ready for a briefing now? I am ready for a briefing now. So, we are expected to descend on the LSO Hotel RNF arrival. That is going to be chart 10-2, 27 November 2020, effective 3 December. Same charts, same charts for Heathrow Airport in the UK RNAV Star. Encountered Vulcan device loss error. Okay, stand by, guys. Alright, guys, we are back from the sim crash. So, again, uh, Alasso and Hotel Heathrow 10 2, November 2020, effective 3 December. Same charts. In charge MSA for the airport reference point 2300. Condition level right now is 75. Routing, descent planning. Uh, Aliso to Rotno at back set level 180. Tiger, Leonium Echo 01, 250 knots maximum. Yeah, that diesel, that's too much. Um, New Milan Africa 01, max 250 knots. Big in, max 220 knots, flight level 70. When and don't proceed beyond big in, he'll be orbit of agency clearance. If we have to, we have to uh, 
hold on 122 radial center right turn holding. Actual descent clearance will be instructed by ATC. To commence initial approach from Biggin Hill, chart 10 2 Papa. 27 November 2020, effective 3 December. Initial approach, same chart, same charts. Initial approach procedures are designed for moving speeds up to 220 knots. Continuous descent approach should be used whenever practical unless the rest is tracked by ATC. MSA London View R from the north e, northeast sector clockwise south correction west southwest sector 2100 northwest sector 2200. So from Biggin Hill, track outbound radial 273 to 9 DME to cross 277 radial at minimum holding level. Radial 293 at above 6000. Radial 301 at 3000. Turn right, Biggin Hill, 9 degree, 2500. And 10 DME, localizer 3000, 7.5 DME, 2500. For the ILS, runway 27 right. Chart 11 4, turn January 2022, February 27 January. Same charts, same charts. Frequency spell bush, MSL and VR, same with the initial approach. At 2500, follow the 3 degree glide path down to minimums of 278 feet where we should see the airport environment or ground environment of Papi Lights left side caliper type 2. If you don't see any of these, climb straight ahead and pass it with as a 580 or 0.0 .0 DME localizer. Whichever is later, climbing right turn on track 316 to 3000, then as directed. And for radio failure, see 11 6. Short prediction we have extra fuel, 7.6 tons or 1 hour and 58 minutes. Let's go ahead and. So level 180. Sent alt blue, flight level 180 blue. Pilot flying flow will be doing a fully managed accelerated approach, auto thrust on, config full, V app stabilized above 1000 feet above aerodrome level. And uh, for chart 10 9 or alpha, the Papi lights for 27 right. is three degrees on the left side. Chart 10-9. 19th March 2021, effective 25 March. Same chart, same chart. Runner heading is 269. Landing distance calculation, max weavers, auto brake high. And to expect a big hit on Alpha 11 or Alpha 10 Whiskey, Alpha 10 Echo. Alpha 10, Alpha 11 is the most we can do. We will be expecting terminal to via Bravo, either Kilo or Lima. Possible parking stands will be 211 onwards. Actually, wait, not here. 216 until 258. That's pretty much it. Threats. It's going to be a heavy plane, so I can flare early, maybe 50. And it will be a busy frequency. Again, our call sign is Springbok 238. Parallel wire operations, T only, fatigue, so standard callouts. If you have to um, reconfirm any anything like a procedures, Please call it out. And um, that's it. That's our ever briefing. Alright, that's it. So, listen, we will use the loo for a bit. Uh, either way, you need to squat more Charlie, ideally just disconnect and then reconnect when you're back and we'll fit you back in once you're back. Uh,
Right. Just use the toilet and we're good. Eleven control, hello, Springbok two three eight south of Heathrow, Aliso one hotel arrival level two six five descending. Walking four zero seven six now from Buck two three. Thanks. Uh, defend flight level uh, one five zero. So level one five zero from Buck two three. Five thousand set. Magenta level one eight zero magenta. I think we'll have a little bit of light on um, the arrival. There you go. Nothing in hell like C20 knots.
<laughs> All right. <laughs> Anticlimactic. So big and hell is 220 knots. Okay, what if we did 210? Would that be any better? Okay, so here's the thing about the clearance. He did not give us uh, anything else. He just said level, just descend level 150. Then say by the star to be leveled by Etbax. Speed out constraint star. So what is it? Just a little bit of scent, all blue. Damage to scent, scent, all blue, go on, how's your blue? We got you done in plenty of time. <laughs> Don't worry. Also open the sun, I'll pull and I'll pass your pull. That's too much, we can do VS minus 800 VS first. And we can do... So in level 9 zero, swing block Reach the speed first, speed three two zero. Are there two nine zero first, yeah. Two nine zero. Speed three zero zero. If I haven't said already, level zero nine zero blue. One 
from Ford Speed Brakes. About seven miles, we'll start slowing down to two five zero knots. Zero, slow down, one half speed brakes. Okay, there is a obstruction. Let's get look over there. Crossing one decimal seven two five for bias for Bach Q three eight zero. Lights and lights on. Frog, GPS primary. Actually, I checked. Ether Director, hello, Springbok 238, level 900, Information Alpha. Springbok, level 800, leave begin heading 265, Springbok 238. 220 knots, uh, speed or less, Springbok 238. Again, what is the uh, the facility? One eight zero on base leg. I think that's the airport. It's going to be a semi net landing then. Okay. Two six five. Two six five blue. Speed out star. I think it's going to be a bit dark when we land. Why don't we make it like uh, 611 local? Which 
Threshold 007, Sun 4000 feet, Spring Bok 238. Most elevated ascent of blue, Fellow 040. Fellow 040, Yeah, sorry, I, I wanted some light. <laughs> so we're gonna give ourselves some uh, some light, I guess. Okay, wing lights off. We don't need that. That's the transition level. So let's hit QNH. 1007. 1007 set, fast check, passing 7000 feet. No check, no difference. Press check the barrack, QNH 1007, QNH 1007. Seatbelts on minimum, MD turn 78 feet, auto brake high. In general, select, it just starts select three more, which is complete. Right. Turn right, right turn, heading 080 degrees, spring block 238. That can be the approach phase. And do CI27 right, radio in to eighty-nine. Exactly, no nav intercept cut while heading. clear for a lower speed we'll do manage speed flaps one speed select one eight zero or we can just do it now flaps one check Three six zero degrees. Spring block two three. Thank you. No ATC speed. Spring block two three. Two trees are degrees from Mach 2 tree. Right, 
I don't think we're gonna get up the stairs we check. So 3,000 feet, we're established on localizer on a 27 right, descend on a glad path, spring Brock 238. Shuttle 1 2 Tango, report you passing altitude. Passing 1,800 feet, shuttle 1 Tango. Hello, Tango, Roger, climb now, flight level 140. Flight level 140, 1 2 Tango. And your speed. DC 3,000 max, step 5 0 round, we found the flight plan. Here we go, guys. Speedbird, crash in the easy free dance mic. Roger, clear to Manchester. Omat, one golf, squawk, seven, six, three, five. We're on the approach now. Speed on start, just blue level, get to the one plus two, checked. Missed approach is 3000. Old star, look star. Star 3000 set. GS. Something is wrong with the sound here. Seven right quit land spring rock two three eight. Go down. Okay, we're proceed for landing. Labs three, speed check. Laps three, laps full, speed check, laps full. Landing checklist, EK memo, landing no blue, landing checklist complete. Clear to land, two, seven, right. Runway in sight. Face zero, one, roger, terminal four, heavy pad, clear to land. Okay, stabilized. One, eight, zero degrees. Disconnect our pilot, no flight. Crossing from the left, right right around arrival. Yes. Uh, police helicopter landing on the tail of four heading about two to the left, wind 180 degrees, 10 knots, clear takeoff. Clear to 5 on traffic formation, loft on 320 departing, two to the left. Clear to 500. Check. Continue.
firm landing is required. Saddle, port idle, middle braking. We get an Alpha 9 Echo, wow. Three to BK to Alpha Nine Echo. Request taxi to any stand terminal two. Two better to Alpha, right to Lima, hold Lima one. Left Alpha, right Lima, hold Lima one. Springbok two three. Point three G's, not bad, not bad. Hey, your track speed brakes, strobe lights, auto, green lights, taxi lights, monitoring. Start APU, start APU. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. After landing checklist, for down productive wind shear off after landing checks complete. Okay, so that's going to be right on Lima, then short of Lima 1, which is actually really short of Bravo. One point three G's. Trim tank transfer. Yeah. Obviously. Springbok 238. It's an early flare for this uh, aircraft. It's really heavy. I don't mind it though. It's, uh, I like the feeling. It's kind of like a. It's kind of like getting a Zevo down. Juliet. This must be Lima then. Sorry, where it said. Left side, clear right side, right on Lima. Thank you 
And brake fan on. It's been. I started this two minutes late, I think. Hey, not bad. We had a 1.33 G's landing. I'm, okay. I'm very okay with that. Springbok. Right Bravo, right kilo stand two three seven spring bra two three thank you. Two three seven. I'm familiar with that stand. It's the stand nearest there. We don't have jetways, uh, sand gates, so we gotta do this ourselves. Left side, right side. Oh, this two three seven. Doors to travel cross check. Be quite a. Roger, climb now. Flight four one four zero. Roger. 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 Roger.
Okay, parking checklist, parking brake chocks, parking brake set, engine is off. Green lights off, fuel pumps off, parking check is complete. Guys, welcome to Heathrow. No jetways, obviously. It's not Sam. We were given spot 237. That is okay. That is fine. Hope you guys enjoy the flight. Uh, the landing is, well, it's 1.3 G's, so it's I think it's good. So we'll disconnect from Vatsim and uh, put some notes here. Ground, tower, center, departure. Uh, Marshall ETC. My first flight from Johannesburg. From Africa. South Africa. Like. Let's check this. Not bad, not bad, not bad, not bad. I mean, sure. The rest of the descent. Wow. Well. Minimum. 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 The rest of the descent rate. And that was pretty good. Nice. Yeah, that was good. Wait a minute. I'm pretty sure this. Oh god, this this. I'm yeah. I forgot Heathrow has a slope runway. We got it on center line. We had a touchdown zone. I think success is what I want to describe this as. Success. Nice. Hey, nice. 1.3 G's. That's pretty good, dude. That was pretty good. Nice. Nice. That was awesome. Nice! Oh my gosh, that was actually pretty good. I might screenshot that. Hold on. Yes, that was great. Point three, I'll take that. Yeah, look at the look at this upsloping runway. I did I do I do forget that it does upslope. If it was not upsloping, yeah, I mean, it could have been less than 1.3. I think that's very good enough. It's very good enough. Wait, do the AP40, does the AP40 come with uh, 
fuel dumping. I mean, what is this? Hey, not bad. Heather is always a challenge if you want to land good, uh, well there. Not bad. Hi hey guys, again, I hope you enjoyed this uh, long haul, sort of. My name is Sky Blue AK Drew. We'll be back uh, with these kinds of videos whenever. So until then, stay safe. Peace. See you. Two. Two. Fifty, forty, thirty, twenty, retard, retard, ten, five.